All right. Hey guys. Um, I just wanted to come on and mention briefly that I had listened to, sorry, the sun is like coming right in my window here. <laughs> um, I listened to somebody's video yesterday and he's somebody that I, I'd listened to in the past a little bit. I like some of his content and I kind of disconnected because there were, there were a couple of things that kind of made me go, Hmm. Um, but again, whatever it is, what it is. And I hadn't listened to him in a while. And I decided to listen to one of his videos yesterday. And basically, I aligned with pretty much all of the things that he said, with the exception of he had mentioned about the political parties um, being like turf wars, like two bloodlines that were like duking it out. Now, really just stepping back and engaging some critical thinking. And you can clearly see that this isn't what's going on. Uh, it's not about turf wars. It is about them being part of the same team. They're, they're, they're on the same team. They're not they're not fighting with each other, contrary to what we've been led to believe. They're, they're not fighting with one another. They go to each other's weddings. They, they show up in photos together. They promote the same agenda. Um, at the end of the day, they are one and the same. And, you know, when you think about back in the day, you know, kings and queens and whatever, they were like murdering people. Like you, like you don't, you don't just go say, I'm going to run against you. Let's have a vote. <laughs> it just doesn't work that way. Not in this crazy fucked up matrix, right? They kill people. If you get in their way, you're done. You're done. That's the way it's always been. And that's the way it is to this day. So when you, when you see all of the shenanigans going on, it's just a circus. Remember that it's just a circus and it's just deception, distraction. It's so ridiculous. It's so ridiculous. And I just find it really hard to believe that people believe any of the narratives, any of them, that we've been told. Like, oh, you know, Democrats used to be Republican and Republican used to be Democrat and you know, whatever. It's like, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because it's always about divide and conquer. And they're playing for the same forces. This, the, the same forces are manipulating all of them. And they're all on the same team. Okay, they pretend to not like each other. They pretend to have different ideas and policies and what have you. Okay, but at the end of the day, they are all the same. And all you need to do is step back and pay attention. Listen to what they're saying. Listen to what their solutions are. Listen to their offerings. They're all the fucking same. They're no different. They're no different. Okay? I don't know how many times people need to have their head smashed into the cement wall to know that that wall is cement wall. And it's not moving. Some people learn the hard way. And apparently, a lot of people at this point aren't capable of learning. And I don't know what that means for them. Like, I'm not, I'm not judge and jury on that. I'm certainly not the creator of all of this. And I don't have, I don't have that greater perspective of everything going on on this planet. I certainly don't. Nobody does. Nobody does. And if anybody says they do, they're full of shit. Nobody does. We're not capable of that being in a human avatar, being in our human form. But what we are capable of is connecting with our own inner guidance system, which comes directly from source creator. Now, one thing that I completely aligned with this guy on, like 1 million percent, is the only thing that really matters is your intuition and instincts. And I don't know if, I'm not sure which words he used but it's intuition and instincts because that comes directly from our source and there's no one in between. There's no savior. Okay, there's no, nobody coming to save us. 
No political figure is going to save us. Okay? They're all part of the Matrix show. And it's going down. Okay? And it's going to fight. It's going to fight. It's going to be probably brutal. It's probably going to be brutal. But there is a radical, radical transformation happening on this planet with this reality. And for those of you who watch my videos, you know I've talked a lot about this, so I'm not going to like not going to keep keep going on and on and on, not in this video. Cuz I just wanted to like mention that because I think too many people get so caught up in this idea that there's a good guy, there's a bad guy, this person's going to save us from this terrible system. And I said this a million times, four years, four years is what they lead people to believe is that election window. Like you vote for someone and then they're, they're there for four years. That sets up a ping pong and it's deliberate. Okay. You people know this, right? It's deliberate because they're all playing on the same team. Remember, it's a ping pong. And they do it to keep people in the cage. Four years is not long enough for shit. So there is no real change that will ever fucking happen as long as people keep participating in this insane system. And it's insane. It's criminally insane. Like criminally insane. Horrifically criminally insane, actually. Like, I I really just can't even think about it because it's, it's disgusting and it makes me sick. It makes me want to puke. These people don't give a shit about you. They don't give a shit about you. Not in any way, shape, or form. They don't give a shit about your children. They don't give a shit about your parents, about your grandparents. They don't give a shit. Okay? And I can't believe, I just, I, I really, I just can't believe the amount of people that still fall for any of these characters. It's, yeah, it's disheartening to know that there's just far too many zombies on this planet. And I'm really hoping for a purge. And I've talked about that endlessly. We need a real purge. And if I'm included in that purge, I'm included in that purge. Like I'm not I am not addicted to this matrix. You can you can say that. And there's not anything that I'm going to do um, to keep clinging to it. So remember who you are. Instincts and intuition. It's the only thing that is going to help you navigate through this maze. Because it's probably going to get more intense and more intense as the days come. So don't fall for any of that stuff. You guys are way too smart for that. All right, signing out.